reactions. They always show videos of the crowd with the audience's hands raised toward the sky and their eyes closed, just soaking in all the glory. And for someone like me who wasn't really religious in that way, it always came off a little bit weird and kind of creepy to me. And I think that's kind of how people view Wodagay when they see it for the first time. When we come across something that we're not really familiar with, we tend to connect it with something that we are. And in the case of a lot of Americans, those two seem pretty closely connected. So let's try to take religion out of this, because there's this negative connotation that people who are religious are crazy and devout. And personally, I think that's a stereotype and a little bit unfair. But going back to my personal experience, I've always wanted to go to a concert where I knew what to do and that I was passionate about it that I didn't care what anyone thought around me. And that's what idol shows have become for me. I can go to these shows and enjoy myself wholeheartedly just like my friends did in college. And then there's also this sense of unity. I talked earlier about all these moves and chants being done in unison. It really creates this sense of community. No one cares if you mess up, and no one's going to call you out if you do the wrong thing. It's just another way for you to belong to this group. And I'll tell you that sometimes I've been at shows where it's kind of in quote-unquote hostile territory. Either because everybody's looking at you like you're crazy, or there's a group of people mocking you because what you're doing is kind of uncool. But for most WOTA, they don't let it stop them. They came to enjoy the concert among friends... And they're going to have a good time regardless of what people around them think. And that's what Wodagay means to me. It's something that helps me not be this shy Asian kid that I once was. It's something that adds on to the enjoyment of these live shows that I go to. And it's something that I do with friends and people that I care about. And hope to bring in more people who can enjoy it too. Again, Wodagay is not an easy concept to understand. Because there's a lot more going on underneath the surface. But that's just my opinion. Maybe Wodagay means something else to you. And for those of you who have yet to discover for yourself, I hope you can give it a shot sometime and let me know if you feel the same way that I do. Thanks for listening to my thoughts on what Wodagay means to me. Leave a comment below or share this video with someone you care about. And we'll see you next time.